Good afternoon, Geminis. This is Nereida Sirena with Celestial Soul Wellness, and thank you for watching. Today we're talking about how this October 18th eclipse at 25 degrees Aries is affecting us, which will happen at about 4... Sorry. Uh, 4.38 p.m. today, Pacific time. So, um, in your case, it's happening in your house of personal goals, teamwork, okay? Uh, friends, so well, since it's happening in Aries, and friends is so important for you, Geminis, because you need that those people to talk about, to share ideas with, and also to get ideas from, because you are great observers. I mean, Geminis are known for always watching, watching, watching. They're the number one people watchers. They're the people who write the star magazines and people magazines, and they're always knowing what's the latest fashion, okay? And they can always uh, glance and say, oh, yeah, this is what's good. This is what's going on. And as opposed to um, someone else who might start talking about Faust, not that you don't know about Faust, but it's not really your preference, okay? At least not for social conversation, maybe for internal growth. Right, and so anyway, this is what's going on. So you're seeing that group of friends changing. Also, you're noticing your goals are changing. All right, what used to be so important are not as important anymore, either because you've reached those goals or because you're at a different phase of your life and you thought that they were, it was necessary, and now you see that maybe it really isn't for you. Okay. Also, too, what's very important is Gemini is known to be a, one of the greatest multitaskers, okay? They can make money in several areas simultaneously because they're constantly going, 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 going. And they have such great ideas. Just remember to follow through. Very important, okay? Especially since um, you have Uranus Pluto hitting in your eighth house of joint finances and um, partnerships. So make sure that through all this uh, commotion, you're still getting those um, bills paid and uh, you're not signing any new contracts right now because Mercury is in retrograde and Saturn is uh, also hitting you there in your sixth house. So, you know, with money and being careful and with details, very important that you stay healthy because your sixth house is all about health, the outdoors, your pets, all right? Just make sure things are going smooth. Because during all this time that you're moving around, flash, you know, like Hermes and Mercury, that's your robot, okay, kind of like that flash Gordon, you might be pulling yourselves in the opposite direction. Remember the Gemini sign, how it has two, and you can notice it's going and curvacing against each other, not towards each other. And so by doing that, you're pulling, it's kind of like pulling a rubber band in opposite directions. Sooner or later, you're going to snap. So you really need to drink a lot of water during this time and to relax, relax your brain, get a massage, okay, go spend some time with your honey, all right, and, um, you know, just really watch a movie and laugh, you really need to, but do take your vitamins, take your supplements, make sure that any medication that's being prescribed, get a second opinion, because a lot of times nowadays, you know, Doctors work very hard, but a lot of times we can solve whatever is ailing us by healthy nutrition, okay, by organic foods. And um, we don't need to put all that synthetic items in us that only create toxins in other parts of our organs, defeating the whole purpose of us getting better because then we get worse somewhere else. So please be careful because you guys are known to once in a while prefer just to pop a pill you know, from some medical industry, as opposed to really taking control and responsibility of you, of your soul, of your of your whole body, really is what necessary. So remember to Gemini, if you notice some breakouts going on in your face, the location of those breakouts is going to tell you what is going on with your body. Okay, the breakout says it has too much toxins, so know that. All right, Gemini, so it's about your friends. Have some fun. Really enjoy yourself. Know that this lasts for about six uh, months to a year and a half. All right. Also know that, um, once again, just to review, is uh, you're checking out your um, 
joint finances, if anything is late, paid, if it's, uh, if it needs to be paid, okay? And making sure if you are in joint uh, financial ventures that the other person is coming through to you, all right? And if you must sign any contracts during this time, or then tell after, um, before November 10th, I suggest you get it reviewed by a lawyer, an accountant, all right? Just to have all those little nooks and crannies, you know, that the I's are dotted and the T's are, you know, um, popped off. And uh, just have everything clear. You have a wonderful day, and I wish you much joy and happiness with this eclipse. Again, this is Nereida Sirena with Celestial Soul Wellness. You can find me at CelestialSoulWellness.com. Thank you for listening. Peace, share, and love.